Got a package today. And it's no ordinary package, can you hear? Anyway, it says fragile glass and liquid. Well, what that means is it needs to be opened with the utmost care. Done. All right, let's see what we got here. I got some bags. Oh, here we go. It's from uh, Rev Tommy Two Tone on YouTube. Spicy food and hot sauce critic on YouTube. Cool. It is. Ooh, got a little grass stain on there. Jericho Fusion hot sauce. Alright, and let's see what else we got. A little, a little grass juice on there. It's alright. Just a little flavoring. And this is uh, Rev Tommy Two Tones Hot Sauce, Rev's Revelation, John 1333. I have said this to you so that in me you may have peace. In the world you face persecution, but take courage. I have conquered the world. Good deal. All right. Um, this this gives me some inspiration for some road food. But first, I'm going to take just a uh, a taste test and see what it what it's like. Ah, natural. So let's go inside. Let's try this green screen thing again. Okay. Whoa. Whoa. Okay. Um. We're gonna open Rev's Revelation first, and it has pineapple, mango, various super hot chilies, maple syrup, rice. Oh, rice vinegar. Apple cider, vinegar, garlic, onions, ground black pepper, kosher sea salt. Stinks getting old. Uh, da -da -da -da. Spices, Zax and gum. Okay. And uh, got my bucket just in case. Just give it a good shake. Mmm, I can smell the hot. It smells a little bit about like the fish sauce. Fish sauce. Fish sauce. Fish sauce. That, um, well, Vietnamese and Cambodia and, and those uh, type places eat. And it has a. Uh, Kind of a, a little bit of a vinegar smell to it. Well, without further ado, yeah, let's get a good tablespoon in there. Uh, now, nobody in their right mind would eat hot sauce just for the sake of eating hot sauce, but I want to get the full flavor of it so I can recognize it on my food. And I'm sure it's a good complement to food. But let's see what it is all by itself. Maybe maybe it could be a uh, marketed as a drink too. A health drink. Cheers, Tommy. First thing that hits me is a little bit of the sweet. Not very tart. The heat kind of sneaks up on you. It's got, the texture has bits and pieces of of the uh, the outer, the flesh, I guess, of the of the peppers. 
and probably the seeds ground up in there. I don't taste too much of the mango. It's a it's a nice slow heat. It doesn't hit you bam all at once, right? And and uh, yeah, I saw like I saw that one too. Um, the uh, hmm. Hmm. Get another small taste of it. I do taste a little bit of the mango now that the heat is kind of saturated in there. Pineapple, or maybe yeah, it, it does have mango. I'm not tasting too much of the pineapple. I like the crunch of the seeds. Some people don't like the um, the particulates in there. I I think it adds uh, a different uh, level of texture to it. Of course, I'm sweating because I've been outside. Uh, but it's not from, well, it's not only from the, the hot sauce, but, ooh, five ounces. So definitely be looking at uh, this on the, on the road food circuit. Good, good, good. I, I, I do recommend it. Uh, what would I put it in? Hmm. Um, you can just eat it with chips. You know, you can use it as a dip. It's thick enough to be a dip. Um, it would be good for, say, some chili. If you have some, some chili. Um, oh, uh, bacon and egg taquitos, or burritos, breakfast burritos. That would be good for a breakfast burrito. I, I like um, spice in my breakfast burrito. Of course, I'll put. I'll put the hot sauce on Twinkies too, but that's just me. All right, here's the next one. Jericho Fusion hot sauce. It is pineapple, mango, rice vinegar, apple cider vinegar, tomatoes brown, seven pot. I don't know what that is. Ground black peppercorn, sea salt, Zaxan gum. Uh, good, good shake, good shake. Oh, hot heat level, I would say in between a Texas Pete and a, and a um, Tabasco. It, it's sweeter than Texas Pete or Tabasco. Texas Pete and Tabasco, tabada, tabada, tabasco are mainly vinegar based, uh, but that one, the sweet isn't overpowering, so you're not like eating a piece of pineapple or anything, but it's just a good touch to, to counteract the sour. Okay, here we go. Jericho Fusion. Hmm, that's that's a nice smell. It, uh, I, I smell kind of a, a cayenne. Does it have any cayenne? Well, that's probably one of the peppers in there. Coogan, that could be the Coogan chilies. I don't know. I have to get my glasses. More better. Hey, they match my uh, my glasses. Match my hat. Um, do D O U G L A H Dougla chilies. Okay. Brown seven pot. I don't know what brown seven pot is. Hmm. It's a good smell. Hmm. Oh. Now this might be a little unfair in that I'm already getting the heat from the first one, but. I think the, the it's subsided enough to where it won't overpower what's in here. And uh, hmm, it smells like chili pepper, or not chili pepper, chili powder. Uh, so if you open a uh, a jar of chili powder, it's got that. I can smell that. Now I can smell a little bit more of the vinegar. Mmm. 
first thing that hits you is the sweet from the brown sugar or whatever that is. Apple cider vinegar, tomatoes brown, seven. But it's got a molasses or brown sugar taste to it. And again, the heat is a slow heat. It it builds up. It doesn't start out hot because the uh, whatever the sweet flavor is in there uh, is counteracting it. And, and believe it or not, uh, when I was trying out Satan's Rage, the uh, some of the things I read online to counteract heat was uh, acidic stuff <clears throat> because uh, supposedly capsaicin and, and the active ingredients or the, the things that make hot sauce hot or peppers or chilies hot was alkaline. Uh, so putting uh, vinegar as a base for hot sauces supposedly takes down the heat level but it's still plenty hot. Uh, it's a good wing sauce. You can put it on wings. Again, I would also put it on my breakfast uh, breakfast burritos or or some chili. Put a little put a little kick in some chili. But it's it's a decent high. I think this this one um, maybe because I've already had this, but this one is actually a a, a little bit hotter. I would say um, it's still so like here's Texas Pete. Here's the the um, the first one, Rev's Revelation. Here's the the Jericho fusion and then you know Tabasco, but it's like right below Tabasco. Um, it Tabasco is a fast heat. As soon as it hits your tongue, you feel the heat. This one creeps up, but the the peak of the heat is uh is pretty close to Tabasco. Yeah, I'll be taking this on the road too. So anyway, thanks, Tommy. That was very generous of you and. Um, Definitely, I will. I will have to reciprocate with some uh, some goodies of my own. I want to get a chance, so um, <clears throat> go check out Rev Tommy Two Tones YouTube channel. Uh, I'll find the link. I'll put it on on in the uh, description box below. And he's got, I believe, he's got a store. I'll put all that information on here. Uh, doo -doo 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 -doo. So, that's all I got for now. Alright, take it easy. Bye.